Hello, I'm Professor Hannon, and I'm one of the instructors for this Bio3 class, and I want to show you how you can use your iNaturalist app to quickly walk around your backyard and see lots of biodiversity and document it. So the first thing I would do is take my phone, and I would press plus, and I would say take a photo. And in this photo is a crepe myrtle, and I would take a picture of a crepe myrtle because that's what I have in front of me. Another thing you would see here is there's a glassy wing sharpshooter right there. So if I zoom in right there, I could see that. I'd press OK, and then it's going to ask me what did I see. So if I press that, it actually says it recommend or it offers suggestions. In this case, I know what it is, and I agree, so I'm going to go yes. And then I can make some notes here, but the key thing here is to take visibility and make it obscured. Um, everything else should be fine. If you want to double check that, it'll show you. You can press this, and it'll show you where the house, and actually it's a little bit wrong. It's not in my neighbor's bedroom. It's actually in my driveway on the side there. So I can correct that and go there. So those are some of the suggestions I would make. And then you just click it and you'll notice that it comes up on your biodiversity feed. Other things I wanted to point out are there's little green lacewing eggs. Those are the eggs on the stalk. Um, if you come over here, I have this salvia plant, and I could figure that out based on this app. These flowers provide great nectar for pollinators. Right now there's none visible, but there was a lot of carpenter bees. I just saw a helicted bee. I saw a western honeybee. So I saw three or four different pollinators. So be sure to find pollinators going to... Oh, there's a carpenter bee. There's several different types of carpenter bees and hopefully your app. There's a honey bee right there. There's another honey bee. So I will show you a few more plants in the backyard. So we have a lemon plant. Um, I was gonna show you, there's the citrus leaf miner, which is a moth that lays its eggs. So you can see the back of this. You can see our dog. Now pets are awesome. We all love our pets, but pets don't count for this project. If you see up on the wires, like my backyard has plenty of wires, you'll see a morning dove. So be sure to add some birds to your project. And lastly, I was going to show you, if you have any interesting house plants, we happen to have this potted pomegranate. You can get some good insects on that. And we'll leave it at that with the sunset. Sunset over the horizon. Have fun with it, that's the most important thing. And be sure to ask any questions with the messaging app if you have any. Thanks.